Hi guys, um, today I'm going to be doing our life hacks video. Let me look in the book I put my things in. By the way, I write the life hacks down just so that I don't have to spend the time thinking in the video. It's just because that'll bore you guys out. So I just brainstorm and then I use the book that I brainstorm in when I make the actual video. Um, so when I'm looking at this book, I'm not copying anybody. I'm just using my own brainstorms. Um... So, this week I am doing sleep life hacks. Also, it's very late. This video is very late because of my puppy. Um, he had a surgery. Um, I was taking care of him for it. And he got a little bit of the, I wanted the infection that was in a root. In one of the teeth he had pulled on his, in his eye. It's not that red anymore because he's on medicine. But before he was on medicine, it was red and it still blows up now and then. Just, he just had it medicine so he's good but yeah sorry if i'm really hugging him a lot he's really so yeah just wish him luck say hi <laughs> yeah he's still a playful little dog and he's very good with little kids i'll show you my little cousin but he's two and this guy is very good with him all right so you should always keep a spray bottle next to your bed to spray yourself in the morning if you're one of those people who cannot get out of bed. Um, turn the heat down. It's not good for you to have it and bundle up. Make sure if it's cooler and you're bundled, it's better than it hot and you being kicking off the sheet. It's just something doctors recommend it. Um, set alarm to wake you up 5 to 15 minutes earlier than you need to. This way you have time to wake up before you have to be like, oh, gotta be at the door. Um, to minimize waking up, getting things for your pets or little kids. Um, give them everything they need and they can do for themselves. Um, I know this won't really work with newborns but unless it's something that they absolutely need your help for give it to them already that way you can minimize it to the least as possible um next um is have a noise machine in everyone's room there's always going to be a time where they want to sleep when everyone else is awake and all that depending on if it's a little kid taking a nap if they, um, it's just to drown out the noise, or if you're sick and you want to take a nap, or if you're, have a teenager sleeping in. Alright, next is, take a warm bath before you go to bed to calm you down. This way, if you're really overly stimulated still, just do the bed and then go to bed. When you wake up, take a cold shower. Now, you don't have to do soap and all of that during these things. You can do your normal shower routine when you do it, but when you first wake up, take a cold rinse off and just sit in the bathtub when you go to bed in the warm one. All right. Set multiple alarms to avoid not waking up and put the alarm um, away from your bed so that to stop it, you have to get up because then you'll already be awake a little. All right, guys. So, bye. Hope you enjoyed the video. Also, I had a bonus video this week, so that's why I am not that mad about it being up a very late day. But, bye guys. Um, this is my little pretty baby. You're a good boy. He likes his tummy rubbed. And to be close. Alright guys, so bye. Hope you enjoyed the video. Say bye, buddy.